Hello, my name is C. William Harper, and welcome to Purpose Directed Success. On this edition, I'm going to be talking about what is your problem? Why haven't you moved? <laughs> and I don't mean move out of my house or something crazy like that, but why haven't you moved up in your business? Why haven't you gotten another pin level or another promotion or taking your business to a new level? Why? 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 I'll tell you possibly why. Or why would you make more money? <laughs> Once again, I'll tell you why. More times than not, when we hit adversity in our business, we can do one of four things. Thing number one is to do absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. And no, I'm not going to give you all four, but I'll give you a few of them. Absolutely nothing. And what that simply means is you think that the business gods are going to come in and just remove the obstacle. The obstacle is there for you to get better, for you to improve, and to, for you to actually go to a new level. But a lot of times we just get frustrated, like, okay, I ain't going to do it. <laughs> Another thing that you could do, or what normally happens is, you can kind of man up and read up. You can study, you can buy a program, you can get a book, you can you can try to fix it for yourself. You can show that can-do attitude. Pull yourself up by your bootstraps and all that. Now, what happens with that, if you choose that methodology, is you have to learn it for yourself. You absolutely have to learn it for yourself. And in learning it from yourself, you can take a lot of valuable time away in doing that. Some just take the opposite approach altogether and quit. I have a problem. I don't know how to solve it. I don't have the character and guts to ask somebody how to solve it. Solve it. So I'm just going to quit. I've always been a quitter and I'm just going to quit. And then when I quit, I'm going to make excuses as to why I quit instead of owning up that I wouldn't man up or cowboy up and get done what needed to get done. The fourth one, I'm going to have you read the blog to find out what the fourth one is. But guys, your success depends solely, completely, and thoroughly on you. Please don't blame anybody. Don't blame your situation. Don't blame your tools. Don't blame your business partner. Don't blame your team. Don't blame your upline. Don't blame your downline. Don't blame anybody. Just own it. And when you own it, you can find out what is the best option for you. In any case, I pray that this has been a benefit to some of you out there. And if you know somebody out there that will benefit from it, share it with them. In any case, you take care, be blessed, and may God love you real good. And you too can have purpose-directed success. Goodbye.